What the court did to INEC chairman and Tunubu's lawyer makes it look like Tunubu is leaving very soon. Siwu is taking over, if not Peter Opi. Nigerians react. Okay, um, if that be the case, let it be hastened. Because we are tired of this uh, policy of Bola Ahmed Tunubu. Nigerians are tired though. I will not lie to you. Nigerians are very, very tired. They cannot continue in this. Because Tunubu has made too much caricature of Nigerians. He has made a mess of Nigerians. Now, as I'm talking to you, Nigerians are finding it so difficult to feed. Things are now very, very expensive in Nigeria. Very expensive. Just because of this first policy of Bola Metunubu. And even while they are trying to call him to order, he was even saying it with all confidence that anyone that is not okay by it should just remain where he is. Because he's not coming back to change his mind. You see that? So, my dear listeners, I tell you what happened in court today is something that the mouth cannot be able to say alone. Because the way Tunubu's lawyers and the INEC chairmen were, 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 were handled after watching the video, the, the, the evidence video that was submitted to the court hmm, will shock you. It will shock you. And even you will now say, oh, I die, no. Because when we are saying it, they say our mouth is smeared. Say we don't know what they talk. Abby? Okay. Let's, let's check the content, my dear listeners. This is Evening News. According to reports on Vanguard, the Court of Appeals sitting in Abuja on Friday gave the legal representatives of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Bolo Ahmed Tunubu, and the All Progressive Congress APC, the Nord, to cross-examine an AIT presenter who tendered a video evidence in the court. It was reported that the AIT broadcaster Ijoma Osamo tendered a video evidence at the court sitting on Friday in which the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, was speaking during a conference and assuring Nigerians that the results of the 2023 presidential election will be electronically transmitted using Beaver's device. The video was subsequently admitted by the court in evidence. However, after it was admitted, the court gave the lawyer of the respondent to cross-examine the witness, Ejoma Osamu. So, you can now see ex everything that the INEC chairman said and the, all the promises he made, none of them he kept. You see that? He was the one that said it, that the results will be judged by what is gotten from the beavers. But as it is, is it what we got at the end of the day? Is that what we got, we got at the end of the day? You can see now. There, there is a breach of contract. There is a breach of agreement. And that is why people are saying that the INE chairman deserve to go to jail. I don't blame people when they say what they said. Because they know what they are talking about. They know they have said the right thing. And it's true. He deserves to go to jail. With no mercy. At all. We know, with no single mercy. Because he has made a mess and he has fumbled as a professor. I'm telling you, he has fumbled as a professor. Okay, my people, I see the hot so we don't hear everything they happen. We don't see with our own eyes. Everything just they appear clearly. Um, don't forget your comments, your opinions, your ideas, and all that has just been revealed to us this very um, evening. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.